Hello everyone, today I would like to present you my uh, brain dirt uh, driver for uh, four electro valves with LNK Wi Fi module to be able to launch the uh, uh, irrigation system via brain dirt app. So we will start by logging into the controller and though this takes roughly 15 to 20 seconds to log in as controller is starting to connect then it's getting schedulers then it's getting settings which in my opinion is tedious and after 16 seconds as we can see we are able to launch the uh, sprinklers as you may see I will show you that it works almost immediately after that but there are a couple things um, first of all I will show you I will stop it right now when I kill the app I sometimes get problems with logging into the controller right now I think it's not the case Oh, we'll see. Yeah, it's not the case. Works as it should. But sometimes, if I leave the app for two or three minutes and try to launch the irrigation again, the uh, system does not work correctly. I cannot log into the app, I get errors. I'll add them to this video so you might see. And in the second part of the video, I will show you how I resolved this using uh, Sonoff 4 channel controller with. HomeKit uh, based solution, which is, in my opinion, much nicer than Rainbird app. Okay, so this is the error that I was describing in the previous uh, part. So, when I was uh, at the garden and uh, trying to diagnose problems with my irrigation system, I was constantly launching the irrigation system and switching it off. And uh, I was putting my phone for like two or three minutes. Going back to the phone again, I got this. So it's trying to con connect the controller, but it doesn't connect. Then I tried again and I got this message. So I wasn't able to do anything. When I go out of the controller and try to log in, you cannot do that. And you have to stay for like, um, five minutes or maybe less so this is my solution for the problems with Rainbird I bought Sonoff controller that allows me to uh, do my irrigation system using latches I built my own uh, system for the electricity of, of the electro valves I've used the transformer from 200 30 volts to 24 volts because uh, electro valves are on AC voltage so we need just transformer nothing else um, and I hope it will work so this is my Sono 4 channel pro which is uh, controlled by firmware HAA Raven version 2 which uh, will be base of my irrigation system which is consisting of, of three electro valve valves uh, produced by Rain Rainbird and as you can see I've already created the controllers so each controller will work for each valve and it works awesome I cannot wait to test it more. And this is how my system looks assembled. It's not the final version yet because I need to uh, put the uh, rail DIN or I don't know how it's called in English. Um, uh, but basically it will be looking much better. So right now this is the only the proposed solution. And on the second uh, picture, you can see my uh, setup of the 
irrigation system with electro valves and uh, and uh, uh, all wires. Oh, it's not a wire, uh, but yeah, it goes to the uh, to the all the sprinkles in the ground. Okay, so we have the most important trial. Will Siri works? Hey Siri, switch big. Switch big. And it's done. Siri turned on the irrigation system. Awesome. Okay, to be able to see if sprinkles are working, you should look at the top right corner where the sprinkle is. Hello, so today I've changed the setup of my irrigation system and instead of Rainbird driver, I'm using Sonoff uh, which is with Raven HAA HomeKit software and to present you how it works, how fast it works you just launch home up, turn on the big irrigation system and the big irrigation system immediately responds. Comparing it to Rainbird, which takes quite a lot of time to log into the controller, this is instant. Closing is the same. As we can see, this is a very fast solution. Also, you can uh, you can uh, control it using Siri. So, hey Siri, switch big. Done. And controller turns on. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. Hey Siri, switch off. Oh, done. Okay, so this is how it looks like for the HomeKit software for the irrigation system. I hope you enjoyed that. So, to wrap up this video, I want to show you what are the costs. First, I bought the uh, Rainbird Wi-Fi module plus uh, driver for the electro valves and it cost me 561 slotties um, and uh, Sonoff costed only 127 slotties so to compare uh, Sonoff here wins definitely as uh, it is more or less 150 slot, uh, 150 dollars for Rainbird solution at that time because it was in 2018 and now dollar uh, currency is uh, stronger than PLN from that time uh, and some of it costs now about 32 dollars so it's almost five times so I, I'm definitely going on Sonoff solution. And, uh, in. So, the final part two uh, functionalities. The Rainbird app uh, is a very comprehensive app for irrigation systems. And um, first of all, uh, it's easy to set up uh, schedulers from the box. There is no need to do the configuration of Sonoff controller. Because Rainbird has this LNK module, which is very well integrated with the with the uh, Rainbird driver. Um, but there are some cons of the Rainbird solution. First of all, Rainbird app does not have easy way to set up Siri shortcuts, so controlling it via voice is harder. Uh, you can do some. Uh, scripting but I wasn't uh, interested in doing that because it's not so easy to do and and obviously I'm talking 
this whole film about iOS because I'm an iOS user. Android users uh, would have, I, I, I don't know the rainbird for, for Android, but some of uh, part I think is more or less similar regarding the how fast this works because there is a mode do it yourself in Sonoff uh, which allows you to uh, set up the Sonoff in a way that it does not communicate with Chinese servers but are, they are working within local network so it's quite fast but that was a side note and uh, the second cons of the Rainbird app is that it's extremely slow regarding login and sometimes it hangs uh, and does not allow to uh, use controller for a couple of minutes so this is for me very um, not good way but if you have uh, set up the schedulers and you are not using the app to uh, I don't know play with it then for sure Rainbird driver will be uh, a good option and I think in that case you don't need the LMK Wi-Fi uh, uh, module and the last part uh, uh, Rainbird is ex horribly expensive in comparison to Sonoff so yeah and now uh, the Sonoff part so Sonoff app for iOS uh, home app is very fast and very responsive within Wi-Fi network that you are operating. When you have iPad, you can create aut automation and also control the system outside of the local network, like uh, with Rainbird uh, Wi-Fi LNK module. Sonoff allows you to integrate with HomeKit, which brings you much more possibilities like automation of lights, creation of smart plugs, etc. This can be very handy while Rainbird is only for water, water sprinkling and turning 24 AC volt devices if you have some of them but obviously it's not so convenient to launch them. Um, Raven version 2 HAA software on Sonoff which I have a very easy easily integrates with Siri so you can play with your kids on the summer with sprinklers and the last thing did I mention that Sonoff is much cheaper yeah so I'm definitely going with Sonoff I hope you enjoyed this, enjoyed this video